it's Mark Tudok from Fayetteville Multirotor. I'm going to show you how to properly get ready for a race with us or most of the other people as well. So usually you'll have an announcement. For example, on Discord, we just released our rookie track. And here it's usually posted a track name and then a pilot name and then instructions of what you're supposed to do. So the first thing you need to do is download the track. So you can see here it's player name Bashikami. Kami, maybe. Uh, I'm going to copy that and then I'm going to go over here to track editor, my Velocity drone, and then I'm going to go download track and I'm going to put in the pilot's name there and I'm going to click search. And right here, this is the track. I'm going to click download. Track download successfully, so that's good. Close that. Go back. I'm going to go single player. And you want this TBS spec quad, the orange quad, because of the way that this particular quad is set up. You can't, people can't change how it flies. You can change your rates, but none of this stuff can change. That way it's fair for everybody. So you take this quad, you select quad. Now you get your track. Uh, this one, you can do a different ways to filter it. One way is to click new tracks. And then you can go to all tracks, and it was called E-Rookies Football Sam. See, I actually downloaded it twice. That's why there's two. So um, I'm going to click that. And then what you want, this is a new format here that Ashley did. You want single class three lap race. So if you scroll down here, you're going to see single class, single class three lap race. You click that, select scenery. Turn on your radio, <laughs> helps. And then what you're going to do is you're going to fly the course. Race. Okay, now that you've flown the track, if you have auto update on, it's going to show you this screen. If you don't, it'll say upload to leaderboard, and then you'll get this screen. And you can see here it's got you and your time, and then where the other people are. And that will give you your time. As long as you've got this time on here, that means you've got a qualifying time in, and then you're good to go. So then you want to show up in your Discord that night, whatever time they say, and then they'll, the race directors will take it from there. But this way you at least know you've got a time on the leaderboard.